Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Let's Play. How are you guys doing today? You know, I'm doing really good. It's been a pretty good day so far. It's f so hot outside. Oh my goodness, summer is in full swing. I know, I know, I know. It's July. What do you expect? Anyways, last episode, we went through the infamous uh, Slowpoke Cave and met Kirk. Of course, Kurt the Invincible, because apparently he can fall off of giant ladder and completely, apparently disables himself to where he can't walk, and then he comes out of nowhere and, yeah, you just gotta watch the last episode. He apparently breaks his back and then can walk later. I don't know. Weird. Anyways. Also, we encountered a rival at the end of the episode, which was a complete and utter beatdown. We took Kevin down. Kevin was not that much of a problem. Not that much of a problem at all. And I have a feeling today we're going to be taking on the second gym and it won't be any problem at all either. So first things first, party update. No, we didn't have a grinding montage. I didn't feel the need to do one at the beginning of this episode because I really don't think we're going to need it. So first things first, we're going to be leading off with Alarxene, our shiny Pidgeotto, evolved the last episode at the end of last episode. Oh, our <laughs> She's going to be the MVP for this episode, I can already tell you. Uh, knows Tackle, Sun Attack, Gust and Quick Attack. Stats are pretty good. Then we got Kevin, our starter, Croconaw, Nose, Scratch, Leer, Rage, and Water Gun. Doing pretty good, doing pretty good in the stats department. And then lastly, we have Cheese, our Bell Sprout. Well, Bell Sprout. We have Cheese, our Bell Sprout, known by Whip, Growth, Rep, and Sleep Powder. Ah, <sighs> ah, <sighs> that's pretty good. Still slow. I don't know. I, I can't remember the level uh, that Bell Sprout evolves. I think it's like 20, between 20 and 30. I think it's 20, like 24. Something like that. So when we ever get a Weeping Bell, of course, I don't think that's going to be for a little bit. So I'm not going to hold my breath. So first things first, let's go ahead and take on this gym. Let's see, make sure I have everything in order. I want to just pile drive through this. This shouldn't take too long. I don't, I'm probably going to speed up a, a little bit here and there. But not too much to where it's just completely just running through it. Because as you can see, I'm just going to use Gust, which if you did not know, flying is super effective against bug types, and it's going to one-shot everything. Like, everything. So, not even a problem. Larxene is going to just pile drive through this place. So, let's go ahead and get done with that match. Oh, I'm really glad we got, the, we got our Pidgeotto. He's gonna sh <laughs> she's going to be... So helpful during the end of the slept play because Pidgeot is a pretty good is a pretty good uh, Pokemon overall, and this is another thing that I always do. If you never like, if you didn't notice, well, actually in the first gym I didn't kind of I didn't have a choice to do it because I had to, but I always like to battle all the trainers inside the gym, even though there are some avoidable ones. I just see it as extra, you know, extra training and, and whatnot. So, if you guys don't do that, you guys should think about doing that. If you, especially if you're playing, uh, you know, one of the more newer versions, like in 6th and 7th, or I don't even know if there is a 7th gen, but 5th and 6th gen, their trainers, I'm pretty sure they're a lot harder, like gym battles are harder, so you're probably going to want to do that. Let's go and take this guy out. Kakuna, I think this guy actually has a Beedrill. This is like the first appearance of Beedrill in this Let's Play. And, you know, I always thought of Beedrill as this big bad B, but even, but its stats are pretty bad. The only thing that's really good about it is it has Fury Attack, which means in this generation, I'm pretty sure it's like one of the more overpowered moves. So yeah, not a problem, not a problem. Bugsy is about to get taken down. <laughs> and before we start on Bugsy, of course, I'm just going to go ahead and quickly save the game just in case if something goes down. You never know, you never know. So let's just save that game. Oh, before we get started, I hope I, I I forgot to say at the beginning of this episode. Thank you guys so much for all of your support on my videos lately. You guys have been amazing. I just I just want to throw that out there. I actually uh I actually posted a video yesterday, uh, a really weird Minecraft SMP adventure episode where I just talked about things I wanted to bring up on the channel. I, of course, I put a straw poll in the description. I'll probably put it down in the description too as well. Go check it out. It's uh, over the next Minecraft Let's Play we're gonna be doing. We had three choices. If you guys want to go check it out, it's down in the description. It'll probably like be right at the very top. Click on it. Vote for your favorite. All input is completely and utterly appreciated. I love every kind of interaction that comes from you guys. You know that. So anyways, I'm, not, I'm done plugging in for that. So let's go ahead and take down Bugsy. I don't know if I'm going to give Bugsy a voice. It's really weird. Uh, Bugsy looks like a, a female, but Bugsy is actually a male. 
So, um, what would I, he's all about bugs. <laughs> I'm Bugsy. I never lose when it comes to bug Pokemon. My research is going to make me the authority on bug Pokemon. Let's let me demonstrate what I've learned from the studies. Okay, not very much dialogue from him. Bump, 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 ba, na, na, na. Of course, Bugsy does have the all powerful Scyther, so that's the one thing we're gonna have to watch over. But really, to be honest, all he's got is a Metapod, a Kakuna, and a and the all powerful Scyther, which I really would like to have in this Let's Play. But I don't foresee us ever getting one, so let's just go ahead and tear through. Oh wow, he took it. He took that hit. He took the hit. Oh my goodness. I think this is also the first gym where they implemented them using potions. So, we're about to find out. So, Metapod's down. I really like... Oh, he's bringing out Scyther already. Okay. I'm going to stick Larxene out and see how well he takes... Because I don't think this Gust is going to be a one-hit kill on the Scyther. Even though it's only level 16. We got Fury Cutter. No, that ain't even a problem. That ain't even a problem, Bugsy. You're the 30 on Bug Pokemon. You should know by now you should not be coming at me with no Bug type moves. Are you crazy? He's a Fury Cutter again. Oh, it took a little bit more damage. But Fury Cutter is that move that gets stronger as you use it. But of course, he doesn't have time because that Scyther is out of here. Get about. Get about. Get about. Get about. Get about. Level 20, baby. I feel so bad. I feel so bad for Bugsy. He stands no chance. No chance at all. This Kakuna is just going down. And peace out. Kakuna's gone. Kakuna's gone. Give me that badge. Uh, uh. Give me that badge. Give me that badge. Thank you. Come again. No problem. Ha! Huh, amazing. You're an expert on Pokemon. My research isn't complete yet. Okay, you won. Take this badge. Do you know the be the benefits of a high badge? If you have it, Pokemon at level 30 will obey you, even if you tra trade him. Apparently trading is a thing. People that know the cut is ability to be used outside of battle, too. Here, also, you can have this. And that is Fury Cutter. TM49, Fury Cutter. Fury Cutter, it contains blah, 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 blah. Bugsy, you're irrelevant. Get up out. Get up out. Goodbye. Nobody cares about your bugs. <laughs> no one cares about your buggies. So let's get up out. I want to get to uh, Golden Ron City this episode, and then I probably will end it off there. Oh, one thing I forgot to do. Let's go ahead and do this. This is going to be the only time you ever see me use a phone. I remembered at the beginning of uh, the ending of last episode, and of course that was a couple days before I recorded that. Um, but I forgot to call Professor Elm back. And you're supposed to call him after the egg hatches. So yeah. What, Bal? How is the egg? What? It has to... Wow! What kind of Pokemon is it? Please, come show me! And he's gone. But yeah, I'm not going to go back there for a little while. I put... Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys. I put Joy in Shaniqua... Or Shaniqua? Shani Sh 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 Sheila? Sheila! Stupid. Sheila in the box, because I really don't need... Ooh, Index Forest. First, first encounter. Uh, do I have any balls? Don't quote me on that one. Do I have any Pokeballs? I do. Sweet. So, let's go ahead. I want to go ahead and put cheese on the lineup. No. Cheese. There we go. So, put cheese on the lineup. See what we get. Because he knows sleep powder. So, that would be good. Hopefully, we can see. It. I really kind of want. I know there's a bunch of bugs in here. Let's see what we get. It's a Weedle. Aw, it's a little Weedle. Aw. It's only level 5. It's a Weedle. Oh, well. Put it to sleep. Good night, and good night to you. Even though it's just a Weedle, and it's level 5, I might as well catch it. Because, why not? Because, you know. Let's go ahead and get it. Get her, get it, get it, get it in my party. And we got a Weedle. I mean, I'm kind of disappointed. But at the same time, I mean, come on, it's a Weedle. It's barb on top of its head sh scratches a sh wait secret secret Sc secretes oh secretes I'm stupid secretes a strong poison it uses the toxic bars to protect itself 
All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Oh my god, look at that little sprite model thing. Oh, that's adorable. Um, we're gonna call it... I'm gonna call it... No, it's a male. Dang it. Um, we're gonna call it... Roger. I don't know why. I'm gonna call it Roger. <laughs> if, you, if you... Is that a... Does Roger have a D in it? If it doesn't, it does, it does now. Roger. Roger. Eh, that's close enough. We're gonna call it Roger. Let's look at Roger. Even though if I spelled Roger wrong, I'm I'm keeping it Roger because Roger is a great name. <laughs> but yeah, it's level five. Stats are pretty dismal. It knows. I mean, it knows poison stain, guys. I'm probably gonna box box it. I'm sorry, poor Roger. So who? Ooh, let's see what else we would have gotten here. Oh, uh, just another Weedle. I guess this cave just has a bunch of Weedles in it. I think uh, I don't think it has that big of a variety because it's mostly bug types. Let's see what this guy wants. Oh man, my boss is going to gonna be screaming. The farfetch that cuts down trees for charcoal took off on me. Wait, this guy is like foresty guy. Should it be country? I can't go anywhere for it in here in the index forest. It's too big, dark, and scary for me. You puss. Get about. Get away from me. You're scared of this cake. Let's just take down this guy. Uh, you're scared of this forest? Seriously? Ah, oh, cool. He, he can't hurt me, so I just want to speed through that. Cause uh, cocoons and metapods actually. Ooh, it's a bird. I actually do get pretty good XP, so give me that XP. Thank you. Level 17. Le learning poison powder. Okay. 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 We have sleeping powder now, which is good for capture. So I'm gonna keep sleep powder. Stop learning poison power? Yes. Okay. Moving right along. Hello. It's a Pokemon. It's the Pokemon that's missing. Farfetch. Qua! Qua! I think that's how you pronounce I think that's how you do it. Qua! <laughs> Get back here. Qua! I'm shaking my head when I do that. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can tell. <laughs> It's a Metapod! Aw, poor Metapod. Give me your XP. Thank you. I don't know what I'm doing. I forgot how to do this puzzle. Uh, oh, I'm running out of PP. Wrap. Thank you. Goodbye. Come again. Hopefully I'm pushing this thing the right way. I think I am. Qua! I'm sorry for all the quas. <laughs> uh, I think he went back to the uh, trainer, but I want to go check over here because I thought I saw an item. Oh, I do see an item. Give me your item. What are you? Revive. I guess that's pretty good, but it's a, it's a Nuzlocke, so that's pretty much useless for me. Uh, let's see what else is over here. I faintly remember a trainer being over here. And then he give me, I'm pretty sure there's a guy over here that gives you headbutt. And I want to get headbutt. Goodbye. Your XP is not worth it. I thought there was a guy over here that gave you headbutt. Maybe that's just in the later generations. I don't know. I'll go look later. I'll probably come off screen and do it. It might be up, it might be further up the path. Maybe it is further up the path. Veggie, go away. Let's get through this. Uh, yay! So we got it. Wow, thank you, thank you very much, feller. My boss's Pokemon won't obey me because I'm a I don't have a badge. What level is this thing? Yeah, my farfetch. You found it for me, kid. I can't. I mean, I, I, everything goes country with me. I don't know how to do like. Uh, how do you do like samurai? Oh, without it, we would have been lost forever. To cut down trees for charcoal. Thank you, kid. That's so racist. <laughs> I'm so bad. Now, how how can I take you? I know. Here, take this. Got TMHO one. TMHO. That could that uh, that has cut. Yes. Pokemon to clear smart trees. Of course. Have the gem bad from Isaiah Town. I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> Do I have anybody who can even learn cut? 
I'm really weird about this, and I really- Oh, where is it at? Right here. I'm really weird about teaching, like, important Pokemon HMs. <sighs> See, Cheese can learn it, but I really don't want to teach it to him, and Kevin can learn it, but I don't want to teach that to him either. I need to find an HM slave. Hold on. Really quick. Let's go- No, go away. No, go away. No one likes you. Go away, Metapod. Thank you. I want to see- Oh, no. oh god dang it. Uh, I want to see if uh, if I have an HM slave inside the box. I bet you that rat attack can learn cut. And we can go ahead and box uh, Roger. I feel like I spelled Roger wrong. Guys, if I did spell Roger wrong, tell me down in the comments. <laughs> uh, goodbye, Roger. Goodbye. Let's see. I'm pretty sure... I feel like the rat attack can learn it, and I feel like she Sheila can learn it. So let's take Sheila, and let's take Ratatat, or Noob the Ratatat, because I don't want to make two trips on this one. I feel like one of these two can learn it. Let's see. Where do we got here? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Um, cut. Let's see. Yep, they can both learn it. Oh, no, we can't. Noob can't learn it. She Sheila can. So you can learn cut. You take the cut. Goodbye. Um, and then let's put new back. I want to hurry up and get uh, out of here because I'm done with the diet town. So let's take new, put him back in there. All right, so let's get out of here. Get out, 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 get out of here. All right, peace out of the town. I'm out. I love the music in this game. They did, they, they really did do a good job with this music. I really need to get some repels, seriously. Do I have a repel? I might. Let me look. Do I have a repel? Yes, I do. I have a. I have a repel. I used to buy these things like in like nobody's business, and then use them. But then I, I'd get. What is this? What are you? Index Forest Shine. It's an honor. The Forest Protector. Hmm. Pretty sure there's no way of catching Celebi in this game. Just saying. <laughs> Let's see, X attack, pretty good. I'm pretty sure this, I, I, the reason I'm kind of quiet because I'm thinking, is there a headbutt somewhere around here? That guy gives you headbutt. I gotta get to him. I don't know how to get over there, but uh, I think, I'm pretty sure, I'm like 99% sure he gives you headbutt. Let's get over there. We still got a repel on. I'm not gonna even gonna, nope. Let's see. Sorry I'm using the speed up button, guys, but I really want to get over here. Does this give it, come here, come here, guy. Come here, do you give, oh, God. My repair my off. So what am I doing? I'm shaking trees using headbutt, yo. It's fun. Here you go. Yes, I got headbutt. <laughs> let's see. Rattles trees sometimes. Blah blah blah. So let's see. Uh, do I want even want to teach anybody headbutt? Kevin would be the only one who would teach him headbutt because uh, because normal type moves are physical and he's a physical attacker. Let's see who can learn it. I bet you everyone can learn it except for Bell Sprout. Called it unlock scene, but um, what do I have on you? It's weird because Croconon doesn't learn very many good moves, and that's sad. Let's just remove Scratch. That's actually good. That's a good trade off. That's a good trade off. Um, let's just go ahead and use it because why not? Nothing happened. Well, that that was that was pointless. No, Caterpie, go away. Let's get through. Go away! Oh my goodness! No, I do not want to use Headbutt. Let's see, what do we get? Ether, that's fine. We might be using those. It's always good to save those. I always save them for the Elite Four. I don't know why, it's always something I always did. So let's go ahead and get out of this battle. I should have I should have healed myself. Look, go away! What do you got? Whoa, hello! Usually the people that, that aren't looking at you won't battle you, that's a new one. He's got a bug catcher, what do you got? He might have been using a headbutt. He's got a, a lady buff, really? Lady, really, bra? You got a lady, bra? Scrub, scrub a dub dub. Get up out. If you guys did not know, Lady Ba actually has the perfect stats to actually give like the most damage ever calculated award or something like that. I saw that off a uh, some YouTuber. I can't remember his name. Jay Wits. I think he's the one who did it. And it's like it's so much damage. It's it's incredible. He's pretty cool. I haven't watched him in a long time, though. So let's get out of here. Get up out. Get up out. Get up out. Get up out. Goodbye. No! Dang it. Get out. Thank you. Alright. Ooh. Is that a Butterfree? Oh, it's a Butterfree! What do you got? Honey, H... 
Wow, she just gave me an HM. Thank you. Sweet scent. Thank you. I did not even know. And we're back! Sorry about that. I had a little bit of an interruption. But yeah, we got Sweet Sin, even though it's a worthless DM. Um, I never usually... Ooh, when did you get paralyzed? Hold on, real quick. Paralyzation heal. Use. Thank you. Now, the chances of me running into this here are very slim, but this is a new route. There is a very slim chance of seeing a Ditto here. And I really want to use a Ditto. Because Dittos are so cool. They're like that uh, miscellaneous thing. So, let's see what we get. Yes! It's a Ditto! <laughs> I'm so happy. Okay, cool. So we got a Ditto. Uh, let's go ahead and use Rap on it. Because I know Rap won't kill it. Nah. Let's see, you transformed into me. Let's use Rap again. Rap one more time. There we go. Uh-oh. And Sleep Powder. Go to sleep. It doesn't affect it, did I? What is this nonsense? Go to sleep. Can he really not? Does, there we go. That is like one of the weirder moves. I think that was a glitch in the game. Like if it misses, it says it didn't affect the. It doesn't affect them, even though I think it's just missing. Because I've done that before, and I know he wasn't resistant to sleep powder. Sleep powder is not a ghost type move, my friend. Let's go ahead and just Pokeball the sucker. Let's use a Great Ball because it's a Ditto. Ditto's have a lower catch rate, and I just love the look of that. Is that not awesome? That blue ball. What? Oh my god. You get in the ball. You're asleep, dude. Get in the ball. Get in the ball now. I just love the look of the Great Balls in this game because they're blue. Oh, they're so great. And Ultra Balls are like the yellowish tint, so I just love it. And we got a Ditto. <laughs> I don't know what to name it, though. It's a, anything, um, when it encounters another ditto, it will move faster than normal to duplicate that opponent's exactly. Okay, that's cool. So it doesn't have a gender. Oh my god, look at that sprite model thing. Oh my god. Um, I don't know what to name it. How about we name it Steven? I don't know why. <laughs> if you guys have not noticed yet, I have a terrible I am terrible at naming stuff, so I'm naming it Steven. Why would you not want to name it Steven? Come on guys. Steven is a great name for a Ditto. Let's look at Steven or Ditto. He's asleep. He's level 10, normal type. Alright, he knows transform and that's it. And stats are pretty dismal. <laughs> I don't know why I wanted a Ditto. Well, I can tell you why I wanted a Ditto. Because I would like to breed some stuff sooner or later in this let's play and you know just having a ditto in the background just just in case if I get something cool you don't know you never know man you never know you never know what you can find let's just get through here I don't want to encounter any of these guys yet until I can heal cheese because I'm probably gonna I want to battle with cheese hold on let's go through here there we go and police officer I'll talk to those guys in just a second I know dang it you could not see me! Um, I don't think he has anything that can hurt me. He has water gun. He's gonna crit me. Oh, I'm disabled. Let's just switch out. I'm done being risky. Lark, see, no, let's use Kevin. We haven't used Kevin yet this episode. Let's, let's take him down with Kevin. Headbutt, goodbye. There we go. I'm gonna go talk to the daycare people in just a second, guys. I just wanna go heal up. I know what they give me. I know, I know, I know. I'm not gonna spoil it, but they give you something really cool, and I can't wait to get it, so... Let's go and heal up. Goodbye. Thank you. No, stop it. No, I don't want to get healed anymore. Thank you. All right, let's go back to the daycare people. Now that we're healed up, I probably won't encounter any more of these people yet because I'm probably going to do that off screen. So let's go and talk to this old man. Hello. Oh, no, I can't. Let's do a really good old man voice. Hello. I'm the daycare man. Do you know about eggs? I was raising Pokemon my, with my wife, you see, where we were shocked to find an egg. How incredible is that? Not very. If you leave two Pokemon together and they love each other very much. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. Well, have you liked this egg? Then fine. This is yours to keep. Bell received an old egg. I found that when I was caring for somebody. 
Somebody <coughs> poke him home. But the trainer didn't want the egg, so I kept it around. Yes! The daycare people and Crystal, this is exclusive to only Crystal, it doesn't happen in gold or silver, but you do get an egg by the daycare, daycare, daycare people. And I was really excited to get this, and I can't wait to see what it hatches out of it, because I really want it. There's so many, there's a list of uh, available Pokemon that you can get from it, like uh, all the baby Pokemon are pretty much gettable from this yes i just said gettable um but yeah you could get like pichu you can get magby you can get elected you can get smoochum you can get uh uh iggly buff which i would hate if i got an iggly buff but <laughs> i really want something useful because i really need a fire type i'd like to have an electric type so uh ice type wouldn't be bad but i'd rather have a fire electric so either magby uh, elected or pichu i'd really like to have a pichu i've never used a pikachu before so yeah, that's the thing. Yes, I've never used a Pikachu. Blasphemy, I know. <laughs> but yeah, we're at Golden Rock, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. As I have said before, uh, I really wanted to get here to this uh, this town. Next episode, we're probably going to... I don't know if we're going to fight the next gym yet. I'm going to be doing some grinding off screen. Probably go explore some more routes. Maybe we'll do that together. Maybe not. I haven't decided. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. If you did, make sure you hit that like button. You know how much I love any kind of interaction that comes from you guys. Don't forget... Straw pulled down the down there. I'm going to be using that. Of course, I really want to plug that in because I've got a, a series for Minecraft that's going to be coming up. And I want you guys to opinion on that. So, yeah, that's the thing. Thank you guys for checking out the video. I'm really glad if you made it all the way to the end. You guys are the bomb. Amazing. So, I just want to say from the bottom of my heart, thank you guys for all the support. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out, guys. And have a great rest of your day. Bye, guys.